Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a review on a product that is highly promoted by Kim Kardashian's hairstylist, who is super freaking fine. I think I follow him just because he's so fine, but honestly, I'd love him to do my hair. If he got his hands on my hair, these are not extensions, he'd have a really good time. So Chris Appleton, would you mind doing my hair? So this product is a highly promoted product and for the reason, he uses it all the time. Sometimes I feel when artists, hairstylists, and makeup artists use products, they really know how to manipulate the product and use it. Sometimes when an everyday person who really isn't a hairstylist or makeup artist tries the products that these experts use, um, it's not the same outcome. So, here we are. 2021, we can't predict the future, but we can predict no bad hair days this year. Very cute little postcard they add in here. And I love the packaging. How cute is that? It says, wow, the science of hair care. And we need to hashtag color well cult. Let's see if we're gonna be part of the cult. It's a hairspray, in case you guys didn't know it. What it's supposed to do is it's supposed to give you this instant little new. And as we get older, like me, in my 50s, um, things start changing. Even though I don't wear any extensions, thank God, and this is why I keep my hair long, because I'm gonna hold on to this for as long as I can, because people be paying for this shit. Why am I gonna cut it off? But I do see hair is a little bit thinner on top. And I have this fucking calic here that is just so freaking annoying. It goes neither this way nor that way. It just goes all different ways. And in order to style, see, in order to style my hair now here, it just always separates and it's just like the worst thing ever. I hate it. But I can honestly say, pick the struggle, bitch, right? Would you rather not have hair, all your hair falling out, or just a little calic shit going on? Well, I'll take the little shit calic going on. So let's try the product. Shake, 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 shake. It says shake before you use. And then you spray it on. It's supposed to give you this amazing volume. So let's see. Is that just to like spray it? If you did something like this, and I'll put the video up to demonstrate. So unfortunately, you can't see my curls because my camera isn't, you know, the most ideal camera because I'm using my computer. Um, but let's do this, okay? It's supposed to literally hold your hair up. Oh my God. See, that's what I'm talking about. Is it manageable? Uh, hold up. <laughs> hold up, wait a minute. Okay. He needs to show me how to do this shit because he did something like this and you see how it's really fluffy there? But it ain't working here. Chris, can you help? Anyway, it does give you volume. It looks pretty decent. I like that you can still put your hands through it. I do. I love the smell of it. And, hmm, yeah. I think it's a winner because you can actually shape your hair. So I do like it. So good to go. And if I had better lighting, you guys would be able to see a better picture of it. But so far, I think it looks great. I'm gonna see how it wears. Again, it doesn't feel gross like most hairspray. I can't even, if I do this to my hair when I put hairspray on, I basically end up pulling out all my hair because my fingers get stuck in the hairspray. And I honestly can feel like this product, you can shape your hair like the way that you want it and it's gonna stay. I've been looking for a decent hairspray for a long time and I never really found one that didn't make my hair sticky. So great job Color Wow for this product. I am very happy with the way it feels. As you guys can see, I can still put my fingers through it. You guys should try it. So if you like this video, please make sure to give it a like and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for being here, you guys. And until my next video, deuces.